glass turning into the night Locked up all the rest of your life Step it up, get ready to fight integrity, and loyalty, virtues that we are bound to fulfill. These are the characters that define our very existence. Unfolded the trust unwaveringly given to us by the Filipino people. For being a cadet is more of a commitment than just a privilege. The life will be tough, but it will be a life worth living. This exceptional service to the country comes off with difficult undertakings imbued with different challenges. A cadet is then seasoned by these experiences. Through thick and thin, the Philippine Military Academy have proven itself in producing a well-rounded officers of character, skillfully employed to the needs of the armed forces and the nation. Along with free education and other amenities, it provides the noblest opportunity to serve the people, God, and country, taking part in promoting that we are more than scholars. Today will be different. Today, I will choose to serve the better purpose. Today, I will strive to become a productive citizen. Today, I will contribute to the good welfare. Today, I will become part of the noblest opportunity. Today, I will be a PMA cadet. Tomorrow, I will be the change. How do we value honor? Is it ever written? Or has it ever existed since? We in the Philippine Military Academy is accorded in defining this every day in our life as cadets. With a strict adherence to the intrinsic honor code and honor system, we, the cadets, do not lie, cheat, steal, nor tolerate among us those who do. We deal honor as our ultimate opportunity to value the military profession. Along with our beacons, courage, integrity, and loyalty. We take pride in producing well-rounded officers of character with the intrepid spirit to serve the country. As a youth, we are considered as the hope of our nation. These words by our national hero made me think of my contribution for the improvement of our country. In our own little ways, we can be of great help to better understand the deeper meaning of their cultures and traditions. I was able to trace to where their beliefs come from. Because of that, I was able to touch someone else's life. In our own little ways, we can inspire others by being a role model that you can achieve anything as long as you believe. I am Cadet First Class Stephanie Foria Fashol from Butuan City. I am Cadet First Class April Rica Heifer Veslapot, B, a bearer of change. I am Cadet First Class Mariel Bagul Bagul from Lipa City. I am Cadet First Class Kenny Dagoy Dacuba from Sambuanga City. I am Cadet First Class Ralph Rodney Pinzon Librilla and B, a bearer of change. I am Cadet First Class Clerk Brian Gingging Polizon from Tagbina, Surigao del Sur. I am Cadet First Class Judy Lian C. Bugante from Iloilo City, inviting you to join the noblest profession of arms and be one of us. I'm Cadet First Class Jeric Soriano Pagia. Join the noblest profession of arms and be one of us. I am Cadet First Class 
Charlene May Ramirez Resede from Lipa City, Batangas. Be a bearer of change. I am Cadet First Class Tubong Banwa from Abolo, Cebu City, encouraging you to join the noblest profession of arms and be one of us. I, Cadet First Class Trisha Buraga Pascual from Katabayungan Kabagan, Isabella. Once a believer, now an achiever. Be a bearer of change. I am Cadet First Class Don Hope Alburu Bantillo from Masbari City. Once a believer, now an achiever. Be a bearer of change.